today we're going to look at an adventure game. Uh, the description I read was a third person adventure set in London, but that's all I know, so let's get on with it. Well, they're definitely British signs. I liked how the menu um, drew, was drawn in there. That's very... I do like it. Someone's thought, how do we make this interesting? And they've done a really good job. Um, graphics. So we do want subtitles on. What's the tick for? Currently selected, I assume? Okay. Uh, default subtitles. No. Right. <clears throat> Gonna turn the music down just a little bit. I'm not... The, the the font there for Master Volume I think is correct. I think some of these aren't, but yeah. Default motion. Pause. Choose to run. Okay, let's uh, let's get on with it. I do have a coffee here, um, and you can probably tell my um, my cold, my nasal problems still uh 95%? I'm still a bit snotty. Which would make it a month now, which is pretty rough. Okay, so it's a poster in the tube. Which is the underground railway network. <laughs> You're off your rocker feet. You know that. Oi, get back here. Shit. I wouldn't be stealing the policeman's helmets from that idiot. era. Over there! Come on, down here. No, this is the 80s, right? No, oh, I'm sorry. There's a train! Peter! Just don't stop! Okay. You alright? Down. Wonder which way that one. Tap this or no, just hit it three times, okay. Okay, so now I have proper control. That's not great. <clears throat> Come on, this way. See ya. Come on. Nice work. What? Huh? You're late. Who the hell are you? You were supposed to be here 20 minutes ago. I gave you clear instructions. Anyway, come on. We can probably still make it if you're quick. What are you talking about? Hang on, Pete. Hey, mate, can you get us out of here? What? Are you kidding? Didn't you hear me? Okay, I didn't know. We this don't have time for this. A bit of audio Either you're coming or desktop. piss off. But don't expect oh. a refund. This isn't a charity. Guess we're going with him then. Get back! 
chicken. Sam! Oh my god. It's now or never, son! They're over there! So be it. Wait! The um Devil runs through that door! Gotcha! Vibration is full on. No. I don't believe it. Okay, so it wasn't because those helmets and pretty certain are what? <clears throat> Are we play as three people in there. Let's do it. Let's pick a four. Oh, a light. I hadn't noticed that loading icon. That's a floppy disk, but it's also got a pulsing throbber on it. Or a, I guess you call it a Cylon progress bar because it goes between back and forth or a kit you know depending on what cultural references you know do you value all human life more or less are there circumstances where it's appropriate to deceive a loved one or partner There can be. Anything is possible. And to take the life of a loved one? What a provocative <coughs> question. I think I could only answer that in the moment. Are you capable of suicide? I think you'd probably know, but capable? I can envisage a scenario where that would be the best option. Yeah. Like, capable is... What is your greatest fear? This interview will never end. Are you afraid of answering questions? Bad reply. No, you can continue. If you were to be sent on a long trip, how long could you be away from your normal life? Normal life. What do you mean? We mean your. I mean clarification would be great. Your attachments. Your. I mean six months, sure. Whatever was required of me, even years. What if the trip was indefinite? Hmm. Is it? Thank you, Miss Hughes. We appreciate your time. That'll be all for now. Got me on speed dial. You got a spare hour or two? I may have. Suspicious. I'm coming over. Got me on speed dial. So that suggests we've called them recently as well. Maybe? Or just they, if this is a booty call, really want it. But it's an odd weather. Got me on speed dial. Hmm. So those questions seem like she might be deployed as part of the job to somewhere. Mina! M Mina Hughes! But the cameras are low enough that someone could just hop up and knock them. They don't seem very sensibly positioned. Scan for weaknesses. Do I just hover? Okay. Surprised at her clearance level. Because she looks young? What does that mean? Unguarded. Hasn't seen combat. Okay. <clears throat> Unguarded with feelings. What is... That means I can ignore them, or hey, I don't know. Do you what? mind if I get past? I I'm Amy. Amy Ung. I'm pretty new here. I can understand why you wouldn't remember me. I am going to need to get past at some point. Um. So, you're a big deal around here. I thought maybe you could give me some tips. I read your so, Operation Blood Hammer not knowing... Test. You know they use you as a case study there, as an example of how to keep a clear head under extreme... If pressure. I can't be certain they're going to say what I'm telling them to say, how am I going to read what they actually mean to say? You don't need me to tell I... you that. 
hate dialogue trees. Where you just say one thing and the other person says potentially something completely different. Have you been stationed there before? And I've missed that whole dialogue because it really annoyed me that much. Uh, there's good work being done over there at the moment, but obviously it's nothing compared to HQ. I'm really lucky to get the opportunity to work down here. That's great. Hey, maybe we'll end up working together at some point. It would be great to shadow you, to learn from the best. You're currently right. shadowing me. I've heard so much about you. It's an honour to meet the legend in person. Do I go this way? <laughs> Are you taking the lift too? Oh, no. It's been lovely to meet you. Likewise. I don't understand why we were so short with them. And we didn't really get much of an option apart from just being aggressive. Because I didn't understand what, what I was saying. Why didn't we get a look up and down them? They keep getting younger. Promising recruit, that one. Have you taken our training wheels off yet? <laughs> She's getting fast tracked. So where what? do we work? Blasted thing. What's he mean? What does that mean? Fast tracked where? The most intelligent people in the world working here, and we can't even get a lift to operate reliably. I mean are any of the people that work in your department what? lift engineers? Advanced dynamics, your section. I hate that. So I'm her boss. Mm. No. That, I was going to complain about an OCD thing with the alignment of those boxes, but it doesn't matter. Why the special treatment? I've decided to include Amy in the selection process. I hear she performed very well. Let's see who comes out on top. I think this is your stop. Q3D. So she's got a level 4 clearance. They have a level 6. Okay. Didn't realise I should have started walking. Maya Sarai. I kind of forgot to make them close. I did just walk through there, didn't I? No. Okay. I'm nuts. Coming back in. No? Oh, okay. Sus. It's like if Control was made by an indie company. Institute doctor and interviewer. Okay. So, dynamics, and then they've got robotics there. Interesting. Is this a food truck over here? Let's see if we can get something to nibble on. Okay. I would have expected in this rain that she'd maybe try and hold something over her head or be running. Okay, there are no buttons to run quicker. Let's go in this archway. No? Okay. <laughs> Take so you're running a ladder. 
<laughs> to be fair, I text like this now. Too much text, too much thought. Like, you caught over there. <laughs> um, we are gonna lie, but I don't. I don't want to say double booked because that seems like we don't care at all. We just have to make up an excuse that's ex an acceptable lie rather than something just fucking rude. London Terrace. Though I have to say the gardens are greener than I've seen before. Come for a checkup, have you? <laughs> Very good. Can't get enough of my sensitive bedside manner. I've come, it's expecting an innuendo. Got to get green. Got to talk. I'll find someone else. Hey, just having a bit of fun. Save it for the bedroom. Fun starts upstairs. I'm fine with the character, I just hate the dialogue options we're given. I assume we're going to this house down here that's lit. Do you think a, l a little bit of this is too, like, it's a story based game with these characters, right? But we're just, like, completely given, uh,. It's been a long day. The good stuff. Um, it just seems a bit o not open-ended even. Like just putting us in the scene and expect us to push in a direction seems a bit odd. Because we we didn't know we'd be okay. Are you right, babe? Yeah, just had a long day. My babe saving the world again, is she? You make me sound like a superhero. Well, you could be for all I know. Is there anything I can help? You could help me take out the recycling. Hmm. How about a back rub instead? Yeah, I'll have one of those. For later. Is Dylan asleep? Mm -mm. I'll let him wait up for you. Mm. Make sure he's reading and not watching TV. I'll go say goodnight. I mean, it's doing a good job of allowing us to learn about the character through doing and... Hey, Dylan. Hi. Is everything all right? Yeah, but again. leaving work to walk to, to walk to that taxi and then oh, walking down the street yeah, to walk fine. to a house I told him about your two those seem like cutscenes but then I guess it would have been too many cut I don't meters, know mom. I got my 200 meter pad ages ago why do you always forget this stuff right 500 you can't expect someone <laughs> my age to have a memory as good as you Dad said you'll come and watch me do my 750 meters. Please say you'll come this time. I'm used to 400 and the 300. Everyone else's mom's come. Of course. I wouldn't miss it for the world. He'll know that that's some. Um, okay, bullshit. now it's getting late. Time for bed. Oh, come on. Can't I stay up until nine? Dad always lets me stay up a little longer if I'm reading. Nice try. Come on, Dylan, lights out. 
Mum's tired. It's not fair. <laughs> Why is she looking at a co-worker on her phone at this time of day? It's going to say I hope that that's just chapter one. So I wonder if later on it uh, weaves these characters together so that you've got them in scenes interacting with each other or something. I mean, it probably does, but we're not going to have time today. I'm just wondering out loud because it would be a shame if they were just independent stories about three Londoners doing stuff. Is that visible on the stream with how... Just it was emissively bright, and I would have thought it'd be blown out. Chemtrails are real. Of course, they they exist. They're just not what you think they're made of. A gorilla smoking a J. Is that just cut off, or is that what you're meant to say now? It's big for anyone. It's not just an ad. Okay. She uses cray emojis far too fucking much. Lifesaver. <laughs> I hope she gets run over by a bus. Okay, can't go. Out without saying goodbye. Can I go out? Have you done your homework? Dotted every I, crossed every T. You can check if you want. Liar. Wow. Can I go out, Mum? <laughs> of course, buddy. Say hello to Vivek for me. Would it kill you to spend some time with your family for once? So this is the sister. What are you going to do, Emma? Arrest me? <laughs> Take the uniform off. It's so dark. I think you look very handsome. Handsome? You look very tidy, dear. <laughs> are you sure you don't want to call off the engagement, Ash? Oh, I guess I'm just stuck with her at this point. Off you go, then. Text me when you're on your way home, love. That was slightly cringe, but we'll get on with it. Yes, I am still in control. <laughs> Can I get run over? No. Nope. So after playing I Am Dead and now this, I noticed that there, are, there are quite a few games with very British characteristics in. And uh, for a while, our Arts Council was reasonably heavily funding.
game releases to get more Britishness in them. And you can understand why. Mostly because nationalism and Brexit. They uh, they want people to remember that, you know, this is our country. You know? Okay. I mean, Watchdog Legion was set here, and they didn't even bother getting the number plates looking right. So, like, obviously that wasn't, that wouldn't have got them any um, tax write-offs anyway, because they're a Quebec developer, mostly. The Codfather is a good chippy name. It's at least, like, B tier. And son. Oh, very sweet. Bet you five pounds I could hit that car over there with a rock or something. Go on then. Or something. Nah. What if the alarm goes off? Too scared. No. I just don't want to upset the neighbours. You don't shit with. Hey Donna. Hey, you got really here quick. I mean, yeah. Hmm. Not working at the Godfather tonight? Nah. Dad's had to close down for a few days. Right in the deep fat fryer again. Oof. Not Boris that live behind the fridge. <laughs> Nothing that exciting. Just a dodgy batch of scampi. Gave some people a runny bottom. Well, there goes that Michelin star. Runny bottom. What a proud dynasty you'll one day inherit. Are you both finished? Okay, I did turn it down a little too much. Uh, let's go for Tom. Why are they amazed? Did you see that guy just then? The one with the pretty lady? The pretty lady? Pretty lady, eh? I've been watching him from my window for a few nights now. Bit creepy. Internet pool not enough for you. I keep seeing him bringing home different girls. Boys too. Rebecca, I'd have hoped your parents would have taught you about this. Let me explain the birds and the bees. That's not the weird part. He brings them home, but I've not seen one of them leave. <gasps> what are you saying? Well, I've had my suspicions for a while, but I'm now pretty convinced. I think he's building a guerrilla army. That's dumb. It's probably just a weird sex thing. Weird sex thing, weird I Weird sex thing where they don't come oh, back yeah. out. That is a I little... Consider that. It's probably a sex thing, yeah. We should play Knock Down Ginger on him. Uh, knock Let's Down Ginger? No, no way. We've got to be all forensic and stuff. Covert surveillance, like your sister. Emma's only a police constable. Okay, Becky, what would you rather do? Be put in prison for 10 years, but when you come out, you get 20 million pounds, tax free. Or get the 20 mil up front, but you die when you're 35. What are you on about? Come on, which one would you take? I wouldn't take either. They both sound shit. No, you have to. Probably take the 20 million up front, live it up on a yacht. But you die when you're 35. Yeah, I know. Like a really horrible, oh, I didn't. slow okay. death. Okay. It's fine. like a golf I'll game, it. But it's solitary confinement for the entire time. That's okay. And you don't have a bed to sleep on. Just a stone floor with loads of spiders about. You're just adding stuff to make it work. I'm gonna keep rolling. There's the bottom box for some reason, okay. I assume the light would have been suggesting I should go over this way, but 
so what's the, I assume eight means there are eight more charges of gas but what's the two mean two more pellets two more targets satellite dish no no cars maybe it's something else. ah this no Ball has come back. No bottle. Okay. Um, a bit laggy at times. Like the frames are really low here. Okay. Something else nearby. Okay. Is that it? Just wasting time before stuff happens. Check it out. Freaky dude's back and he's all alone. Not this again. Let's see what he's up to. No way. I don't want to be turned into a human kebab. He is pretty fit. You're probably not his type. If you play your cards right, you could be his next victim. Let's follow him. I want his number. When he makes high concept art out of your body parts, don't say I didn't warn you. You only live once. Let's tail the creep. I mean, if he's a you know, murderer, you could definitely he's say he might be creepy. Needs to be the but... is in the gorilla army. Still entertaining the gorilla army theory then? Yeah, I'm coming round to it again. Poor fellows, probably just ran out of condoms. Should have brought bulk on mine. Could have saved himself <laughs> a walk. You can get condoms in the loo at the plowman. Oh, dogs. that was the comment I was going to make earlier. He's actually she said internet porn. For a deranged like, killer. Porn. Can't deny, he's one handsome man. Couldn't just be porn. Almost like, as pretty as you, hun. A filthy mag uh, or something. Make a just a weird blush. way to say it. This has echoes of Viv's other conspiracy theories. Uh, wake up, sheeple. There are crazy things going on in this city. All those three months when you Okay, command them for using sheeple. On that occasion, I was just a bit So he went in the pub, news. right? If. The well's bottom. So we can't go in there. Okay, let's go around this way. I should really have seen the pedestrian sign, but it's right behind that bollard, so... Never been to this part of town before. Me neither. Handsome guy's heading for that old building. Old building. Okay. I mean, it looks like an old train station or something. But the glass ceiling suggests it's converted into a shopping centre or something. Let's see what it actually is. Condemned, huh? That dude walks funny. Guerrilla army's still not off the table. Building looks big enough to be a fortress. Place is half fallen down. Maybe he owns the place. He could probably make a fortune converting that into flats. Okay, but what about all those people he's been disappearing? They're probably all inside, having fun. I guess there's only one way to find out. I'm game. You two are mental. What are you going to do? Just walk through the front door. I think there's another way in. Okay, so take the lead is... Like, how am I meant to know that take the lead means there's another way in? Like... <clears throat> So I was wondering after the that sniping sequence with the uh, the air gun, like so far there's been actually nothing in the game that couldn't just have been part of Let's this being a visual door, novel yeah. or another interactive story that has very little of what well, any of this 3D. So I wonder why it wasn't designed as 
that. It's locked. Oh, that's uh, that's that then. One of those top floor windows. Like broken. the button tapping to get in that fence. I'm sure we can get up there somehow. I don't know. It's uh, it's bothering me. I'm just thinking. I mean, climb up the tree, I guess. Even. No. Okay, we go up here then. <clears throat> I'm just thinking an awful lot of it could have been done in a more simplified way, which really means it could have not been a game. Like, nothing so far has been, this has to be a game. Like, I understand things like Heavy Rain and the rest would... Where is going for a swim? Really? Is this like Cocoon? <laughs> Willing to concede at this point, he might not be the head of a guerrilla army. This is crazy. It looks like an X Man or something. Holy shit! So we're gonna be rich. You are. Get a video kills of you. This. We'll sell it to the tabloids. Imagine the likes. Pap him. Oh, I can't shoot it from here. Let me find the right position. Like, what the fuck? So now I'm holding buttons, like in a David Cage game. What? Leg it! I was holding all the buttons fully. Like, what the fuck? Okay, so that this was literally mental. taking the piss out of David Cage. <laughs> To run. Guys, I'm stuck. Guys, help! Why has he got underpants on? <gasps> Bit rude. What the hell have you done? What do you mean? He was going to attack him at the point. Him. A little appreciation here. I just saved your life. Dude, bollock naked. He's not dead. It's not. He's he? got underpants He's got on. Superpowers. He probably can't be killed. We got a call for an ambulance. Whoa. Hang on there. Let's not make any rash decisions. I'm not getting in trouble for this. This was your dumb idea. Donna, what if your sister finds out about this? He keeps sounding like Malfoy. I don't know. I can't I'm just like, straight. is that the Malfoy actor doing? I don't Let's think so. Out of sight. <sighs> that should hold him for now. Thank God he's still breathing. We have to turn ourselves in. This is getting out of hand. What? Slow down. Think about it. No one has to get into trouble. I'm not sure this is a good idea. We'll never get away with it. Wait. We can figure this out. Oh, shit. Our fingerprints must be all over this place. We can't let him go. For the time being, he has to stay here. Emma? Where the hell are you? Tell me this instant! Just hanging out at Viv's. Sorry, lost track of time. Well, I'm at the Vex right now and you're nowhere to be seen. Uh, just stay there. 
I'll be there right away. Donna. Donna, don't you dare hang up on me. Well? Bye. That was Emma. Your sister. Aye. Yeah, she thinks I'm up with X. She's there now. Emma's at the Codfather. You need to fix this, Donna. She can't come here. Probably getting fish prison. and chips. Oh shit. Hmm. Well, Becky, if she does come here, you've always got the option of knocking her out too. Shh. Why are you shing us, Biff? I was trying to get you to stop saying our names. Why? He's awake. He's awake. Reminds me of the guy in the restaurant. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I hmm. I'm not gonna play further because I assume this is the yeah this dude. It might be an interesting story. I'm gonna have to play it out. But um, as for like. I, I don't say gameplay or mechanics, they're just, they're all bespoke, to like the little things I've done, but so far, like the first one, the first um, uh, Mina, the first of her chapters was mostly walking around environments doing very little and conversing, and uh, I've forgotten her name, <laughs> um, Emma's sister. I mean, we what? We shot some things. We ran down a lot of streets. I just don't know. Why, do, why, why make this game like? Why have like a massive idea? Hey, I want to do this, and then make this. I'm not terribly impressed. Is all I'm going to go with. It might win me over, um, but that's been last stop. It's a little look. I hope you enjoyed it. See you around.